Hey, happy Wednesday. Yes, already January 19th, 2022. To God be the glory for yet another beautiful opportunity to be in the land of the living and to show his loving kindness and to do his work and to be a representative out here. I hope you are waking up to joy. That was a song that I love to hear. I don't love to play, but it's called Black Gold and it's by Sister Esperanza Spalding. And it pretty much reinforces that our little ones of African-American descent, for them to hold their head up high as you can high enough to see who you are little man life sometimes is sometimes cold and cruel baby no one else would tell you but remember that you are black gold black gold you ooh, ooh, are black gold and i know i'm not talking about you know people are like oh no not making yourself an idol no but we're to love ourselves as we love our neighbors right i think that the problem is out here when we hear about soul much shooting and crime is because we don't love ourselves therefore we don't value ourselves therefore we don't love each other how can you spread something that you don't have within yourself so the remedy is to consult with our creator god lord you made me for a reason and you put value and so much people could say black gold whatever white gold red gold yellow gold but the point is we are a royal priesthood we're a chosen nation we are god's special people called out of this darkness to be in his marvelous light so that we can declare the works of the lord that's the point and we would have gone to Psalms 139 and remember David talked about how he was made in darkness. Yea, the darkness hideth not from thee, but the night shineth as a day. The darkness and the light are both alike to thee. For thou hast possessed my reins. Thou hast covered me in my mother's womb. I will praise thee for I am fearfully and wonderfully made marvelous are thy works and my soul knoweth right well we know who we are in christ jesus so when we know who we are we have accepted him as our savior we're not living to ourselves but we are living for his glory then we can live with boldness and gladness and we can represent out here but when we are confused and we don't have an identity woo, and we don't value someone else's identity mayhem breaks out yes sheer mayhem so the point is that we need to point people back to the inventor of who they are for the lord has created each one of us as a masterpiece we are christ's workmanship created in christ jesus so that we can do the good works that were ordained even before we were born we are in isaiah 12 and with this it says behold god is my salvation he is my rescuing force i will trust and not be afraid you don't have to have low self-esteem you can live boldly in the identity of the lord jehovah is my strength and my song he also is become my salvation therefore with joy shall we draw water out of the well of salvation yes in that day shall we say praise the lord call upon his name declare his doings among the people live out loud you don't have to you don't have to be afraid in an undercover christian live out loud Yes, make mention that his name is exalted. Sing unto the Lord, for he hath done excellent things that is known all in the earth. Thank you, Lord, for yet another day that we can live intentionally, boldly, audaciously, knowing that you have made us and we not ourselves. So God, let us enter into your presence, into your gates with thanksgiving and into your courts with praise. Let us be thankful unto you and bless your name. Yes, Father, for you are worthy to be praised wherever, wherever you assign us, whether to that job, to that kitchen, outside, wherever, Father. Let us live intentionally, oh God, knowing that you have put value and greatness in each of us. And we don't have to be shy. We don't have to be ashamed. But we will 
boldly proclaim your love and your joy and your purpose and your praise this day and forevermore. We give you all the exaltation. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen.